adventures. Today I am following this map to find puzzle pieces for today's puzzle. Do you want to help me? Great, let's see. It looks like I take two steps to the stump. One, two. <gasps> There's a piece of the puzzle. Let's celebrate. Now, three steps this way. One, two, three. Another piece of the puzzle! Let's celebrate! Now, three big steps that way. One, two, three. Another piece of the puzzle! Let's celebrate! It looks like a stacking puzzle. I wonder what it could be. Ho! Ho! It's Ollie! Hello, Jackson. Ho! Ho! Is that a puzzle with you? Hi, Ollie. This map is leading me to some super special puzzle pieces today. You found pieces to a puzzle. It's true. I know some people who found something new. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Ho, ho. Follow me through. Follow me through. Aw, oh, 
Aw, Stormy, are you playing a game with your friend Goldie? <laughs> oh, hi, friends. I'm Carrie the Dog Walker, and this is my best dog, Stormy Jane. Stormy and Goldie are playing a game where they use the dog toy to show each other the way to go. This reminds me of today's story. Do you want to hear it? <laughs> Stormy and Goldie want to hear it, too. Well, today's true story from the Bible begins with God's people, the Israelites. God loved the Israelites so much that God promised to lead them to a new home. This home would have all the food they would need, and God called it a land flowing with milk and honey. Wow, raise your hand if you like to drink milk. <laughs> raise your hand if you like honey. Well, this was a really special place to live with lots of food. But how would they find their new home? Do they have a map? How would they know which way to go? Well, God had a very special way to show them in a way only God could do. Why? Because God's got it. Look at your neighbor and say, God's got it. Ready? God's got it. Good. Well, wait until you hear this because God did something amazing that only God can do. God gave the Israelites something to follow so they would know where to go. See if you can guess what it is. What is it? Yes, it's a cloud. This is called a pillar of cloud. And God told the people to follow the cloud during the day. And when it got dark and they couldn't see the cloud, God gave them this. Can you tell what it is? That's right, fire. This is a pillar of fire. Now they have fire to show them the way. God led them by cloud in the day and by fire at night. God stayed in front of them, showing them the way to go. The Israelites trusted God and followed the cloud and fire to their new home where they would have all the food they would need. God is so amazing. God's got it. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who's got it? God's got it. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who's got it? God's got it. That's the truth, friends. See you later. Bye. So there's your story. And it's all true. God shows us the way. Because God's got it. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow. God showed the Israelites the way to go. And God will show me the way to go, too. Because God's got it. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good. Look, when I put these pieces together, it kind of looks like a cloud. I think I'll put this right here in the clubhouse so that we can always remember the story and that God's got it. See you next time. Bye. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Proverbs 3, 5. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Proverbs 3, 5.